I'm Lola, and welcome back to this next part of Enderal. So, everyone's talking. Last we left off, we did the um, angel quest. I'm just going over here to <laughs> stop the noise. So yeah, we're going to do some selling, and then we need, do need to return the actual stone. Um, and then it might be time to do Cuthbert's legacy. We'll see. First, we're going to do some selling, though. Actually, no. We're going to go back to my house, then to the bank to see if there's anything in there. Then we'll sell. Uh, get off there, please. <laughs> it's my go. See if I can improve anything as well, because I felt like I feel like I've not um, messed around with smithing in a while. Just creating some ore. That'll do. Right, we'll go into my house and um, put everything away and then we'll get stuff out as we need it. For smithing, I mean. Brilliant. Put all the ingots away. put all that away leather strips malachite moonstone seventy seven spare parts oh fox pelt miss that can sell those honestly I think that's it any flawless jewellery. That'll do. Anything to put in here? Kind of the rest is just to sell. That's the previous set, isn't it? Uh, we'll keep it anyway, just for... Because it's named... Right, yeah, I think that'll do. We'll see what we can improve, or make even. Let's go to the anvil first, see if there's anything we can create that's better than what we've got. Hmm? Hello. Get off my equipment, I've told you. <laughs> Bone bow, that's like a um, dragon bone, that'd be good. Is there a bone sword? I'm past Starling. I think it might be bone next, but I don't have a bone sword yet, so we'll leave that. What's my shield currently? It's not a great one, I don't think. 83 Starling. And I can enchant it. That's with the improvements, though. I feel like that'll be more Shield of the Righteous Path. Hello. Glowing Thorium, two Shadow Steel. Thorium, Shadow Steel, Gold, Moon, Spare Parts. I hope I remember that. Thorium, Shadow Steel, Glowing, Moon, Spare Parts. Is it glowing thorium moon? Shadow. Spare parts. There's one other glow. I know glowing thorium. I can take the ore for that. I think I'm missing one. <laughs> I tried to remember. Wasn't successful.
gold, that was it. Right, we need a gold ingot. Right, let's get a gold. Oh, it'll be in the chest. Just needed the one, I think. Right, let's just make the shield. Hello. See if I can improve it as well. I can. And then we will enchant it um, when I get to the marketplace. We'll put an enchantment on it. What's it like improved then? 83 oh it's the same <laughs> well there's no point in that was there well i can sell it damn i thought it'd be a bit more what's my current damage i need to enchant that my current damage is 54 Yeah, unless I get a bone, I don't think it's worth it. That was a bit of a waste of time <laughs> with what I've just done there, but oh well. Taught me some smithing at least. Hi, you're smiling <laughs> very well. Sure, take a look. Oh damn, I forgot to. I was going to go to the bank first. Oh well. Well, I'll sell to you first, then go to the bank. Oh my god, how many spell terms do I have? Not- I thought I was buying off of them. Well, I hope I haven't just sold a really expensive spell term. Wouldn't put it past me. <laughs> yes. Interesting weapon you- No, I just put them out for you to look at. Tell me what you need and be quick about it. One to learn there. Hey, you can have those. It's a spell term I can learn. Walk blessed. Uh -huh. Um I was just going to say if there's actually no I need to see what skills I'm at at the moment so I'm expert handicraft now no I'm master handicraft I think 75 master still expert heavy armor master one-handed what am I block yes expert block just put them out for you to look at. Tell me what you need and be quick about it. Yeah, I master that. Think I'm expert at rhetoric, hopefully. Let's go with that. Honestly, yeah, you can have that shield. Oh, no, you've not got enough pennies. Never mind. I can probably get a better bow, but I think I'll leave that for next time. Might as well have those. Twenty one of those. 
You can have all these. Um, those are a little worse, worse. So I'll get rid of three. Walk okay, so the bank's here. Can't remember if I've recently got a key or not, so yes. we'll see. Don't what? remember if I've acquired anything since I was last here. Already done that. Oh, I can lockpick it now. This is exciting. Might take a while because it is master. Damn. Bloody hell. Feel free to fast forward this part, because like I say, oh, I say that. I got it a little bit there. It might be a while. Nope. Bloody hell. Somewhere up here. Hey, got it. Now, I'm not going to steal the... Actually, I'll steal the ingot. Oh, I'll steal it all. <laughs> I'm a burglar. What can I say? Can't do that one yet. Can't do that one yet. I did need the skull for something, didn't I? For a, um... That bow, so I might take that. Well, I have taken that. Oh. Again, I could go in there. But the guard might kill me. Right, I'm gonna save and see if I get a bounty for this. Oh my god, that was easy for a master. No one's seeing me? Let's steal from the bank. I'm taking all the ingots possible. Nothing to see here. Um, hi. Can I not read that? I guess not. Well, we've looted that place dry. <laughs> Again, nothing to see here, guard. Ah, this was a vault key. Carrick, the usual pay for your shipment. I expect the next ingredients at the agreed upon date. Forgot what this is, this is for. But we've got the key. Again, another lock. <sighs> Let's try it again. I've saved again. God damn. Nearly. Fucking hell. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, wow. A magic symbol. So you have to steal to get those. I will take the soul gem as well. Nice. That was a good... I'm glad I did that. And the gold pot. Steel. Only 13 gold in that pot. Rubbish. Right. Anything oh, to steal up here. All loot responsibly because I have a key, but mostly to steal. Oh, 
that's my deposit. I forgot about that. Um, you can keep it for now. That's a no. We'll head back down then, back outside. We've <laughs> looted the bank. Taken everything we can. Don't know if you heard that then, but I've just hit my knee on my desk and that really hurt. <laughs> just banged my knee. Ow. Carry on. Hey, you're an adventurer, are you? Have you been to... No, I haven't been anywhere. I've stayed in bed all my life. <laughs> right, I'm just going to put those stolen ingots away in my house and then I think we'll return the stone. Is that it? I think that's it. We'll leave it there. Yeah, we're going to go back to the Sun Temple now and return the stone to um, the Archmagister. Before I forget and not return it at all. Should be up here in his usual place. The prodigy, huh? Apparently we owe you for the shards of this superstar. Yes, you do. Let's hope he knows what he has to do. Fascinating. Truly fascinating. What's fascinating? What just happened? Well, exactly what we thought would happen, I wager. The stone connected with the beacon. And what a connection it was. I've never seen such energy, let alone felt it. But be that as it may, half a chicken doesn't make a cake. We still need two more stones. And I have one here for you. Yes? Have you found any of the stones yet? Um, tell Lex about the happenings in Castle Dalgala. Yes, I think I found the stone that the Apothecarius had. Here you go looking for a stone, and you simultaneously solve an Endralean mystery. Good work. I had read theories about what happened to the Count, but this is not what I had imagined. Hmm. Well, we know what I became of that girl. That girl. Huh. It seems as if a part of the stone... Yes, we can't tell him. Wasn't banished not that I'd want to, really. Just look at it. It's somehow duller than the others. But still, it should make a difference. At least all that suffering wasn't in vain. Let us insert the stone. Did I walk away then last time after he'd inserted the other stone? Or does he do it when I come back? No, I think he does it now and I just didn't watch him insert the stone. <laughs> Whoops. That's what's happened last time, that thing that I thought was a shower. Indeed. Yes. Well. So we do have Kalia's personal quest like we did Jesper. Kalia appeared to be very agitated in our last conversation in the Frostcliff Tavern. She blamed herself for what had transpired in the castle, what she did to the mercenaries. Perhaps I should check whether she is fine. By now, she should have returned to the temple again. Since she's here, of course. Um, yeah, and then I think we'll do Cuthbert's legacy before we do the other stone. An outlander. Oh god, I've been here long enough not to call me an outlander. I'm going to untoggle the other quest for now because I'm going to end up following it accidentally. You down here? I 
Is she doing some training? Oh, <laughs> Lily chopped me in half, that guy then. Here we are. Oh, you're doing some boxing probably to try and stop thinking about that awful situation. Nudge Kalia? Yes. Is it important? If not, please go away. I'm not in the mood for company. I just wanted to see how you're holding up, you know, after what happened in the castle. Fine. <laughs> we just say fine and leave. No, I'll ask her how she's doing. Saira, what part of I'm not in the mood for company don't you understand? Please, just... just leave me alone, okay? Look, Callie, if there's anything I can do, let me know. What? I don't need your pampering, your pity, or whatever it is you came here to do. I just want to be left alone. But you just don't get that, do you? You always come to me like- I think you secretly like, need someone right now. Why, Saira? Why are you the only one who can't see me for what I am? All the others can. So what's the deal with you? Shout all you want, but you're important to me. Nothing is going to change that. This is about what happened in the Dalgalar's library, isn't it? No, yeah. It's about you being either incredibly blind or incredibly naive. I'm a monster, damn it. A bloody abomination. And here you are, acting as if you are the only one who knows better. That's such a joke. The biggest joke since Star of All, and also the worst one. Back in old Dothalgrad, when I killed that bandit, do you have the slightest idea what my first impulse was when I was done with him? Blood on your face. How helpless you are, lying there. And I would have enjoyed every moment of it. What would you have done? I don't understand. It would have changed nothing. But you didn't, that's, what's ma that's what matters. Mm, true, you didn't. It didn't happen, so... Why? Think about it? I mean, I understand completely why she's thinking about it, but it didn't actually happen. Therefore, I forgive you for something that didn't happen. Is it? So an army of undead is harmless until they massacre the city they are marching towards? I mean, yes. <laughs> you, you just have no idea. No idea how hard it is to always fight back. To not give in. All that. I... Why, Saira? Why do I have to be this way? I never asked to be brought back from the dead. I never wanted to become my father's failed experiment. And I never asked to have this... This perversion put in my head. Which seems to be all that bloody defines me. We'll make something else. <laughs> up that defines you. Be more. Maybe I should just stop fighting it. That's Maybe not the right attitude. The name in the castle is my true face. And all of this is just a part of a mask that I try to trick myself into believing is real. You're blowing this out of proportion, Kalia. What happened in the castle was a fluke, and those men deserved what you did to them. They wanted to. Yes, you lost control, but what you're saying just isn't true. You're not a monster. Maybe the fact that you're constantly trying to fight it is making is what makes it strong. That's a good point. Not out of proportion. She's not blowing it out of proportion. Um, the second one, maybe? I mean, she did lose control, but it, it was justified, so I, it doesn't make her a monster. Yes, it is, Saira. I'm a danger to everyone around me, and I was a fool to believe you could change who you are. You can't. <sighs> maybe I should just leave. Go somewhere where I'm by myself. Maybe that way I could prevent this thing from ever hurting anyone else ever again. You're doing a lot of good here, Callie. I don't leave. Doesn't it matter that you're important to me? Are you doing a lot of good here, Callie? I don't leave. I... I need some space now, okay? I love you how we don't... Just... There's no option to actually tell her to leave. <laughs> Not that I do that, but... Oh, that was a shorter one. That would be a bit longer, like... Jespers. Guess not. I guess she said all she needs to say. And I would leave her alone after all of that. I don't know which way I'm going. Hopefully that conversation went alright. Yeah. I think we're going to
going to do Cuthbert's legacy now then. Yeah, I'm interested to see what the third quest is about because we've got Jesper. We've done our like two companion centered missions. As in like they've come along with us. What's the third one going to be? The third stone. That'll be interesting. But not just yet. <laughs> do it soon, but not yet. Um, yeah, so we need to return these doors and potion too. Might be best to go to Duneville's tower. Yeah, I'm going to go back to the mirror tower and then travel to Duneville. Should have slept really to get my health up, but I guess I can eat something. Sir. Right, blessed. off we fly. Where are you head? Sure. Where to? Um, Duneville, please. <laughs> yeah, I thought we'd do this quest now. Finally get it completed. Been informed that it's one I should do. I'm trying to do as many quests as possible, but it's Apparently quite a good one. I didn't mean to eat raw beef then. Oh, I forgot to learn my books. Oh, for God's sake, I'm not a master. Did I buy a master? I might have not. That might have been from last time. I guess I'll just learn more of these in the future. Yeah. Oh well, I learnt a couple. How many points? Bloody hell, I have a lot of learning points. <laughs> I'll probably do next episode before getting the stone, just grab a load of learning books and try and get as many as I can. Get everything learned, everything leveled up. I think that's the plan after I finish this Cuthbert's quest. I kind of should be staying on the path. I'm kind of going the wrong way a little, but I guess if I circle around here. Ah yes, I've been in here, the hollow hand. I remember this place. Just keep going on. I think it's the tower here I need to be at. I accidentally antagonise you, sorry. I guess if you get close to them they'll attack you, otherwise they'll leave you alone. Oh, I spot one of you. Leopard. I think I looted this chest before, but I'll just check. Yeah, it did. And the jewellery box. Repair front door! Hallelujah! Hello! I've put a door in place. Do you like it? Hmm. I have the potion as well. Here you go. Ooh, show me. Mm -mm 
Mm-mm-mm, looking good. Uh, well then, let us wait until nightfall. Okay, will do. Come on, let's go downstairs. Alright, after you. Isn't this upstairs? <laughs> I'm sure this is upstairs, but... <laughs> Please take a seat. Take a seat and witness the ritual. We're here. Let's see what happens. Well then, I will now reach out to the voices of the new age. You need to create a mental image of the deceased and focus on it at all times. Understand? That's the only way we can find him in the beyond. Okay. Oh, this dance. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, first gate. oh my god. Open. Oh, second the hell? gate. Open. Oh, third gate. Open. <laughs> Voices of the new age. We channel you. Oh, child. Oh my god, do you think you're loony? Voices of the new age. Why did you channel us? Um, somebody died. I want to Oh pain. Such grief we His voice. feel in our hearts. Steer your thoughts towards this sweet soul and we shall call it more. <laughs> um, form a mental image of Tabacus. Tabacus's mini pig. Um, okay. <laughs> oh, yes. I forgot we what we were doing this quest for a second there. We see it clearly. A faint will o' the wisp in the current of souls. Oh, joy. joy. Such golden hair. Such a wealthy bosom. Oh, and look. She wants to talk to you. Um, okay. <laughs> Moon of my life. My heart jumps for joy at the thought that you underwent all these trials to speak to me. But rest assured, I am well. I am in a better place, passionately yearning for your arrival. But please, take your time, for you shall have a long and fulfilled life. Whew. That was um just a little. Intense. Is this a joke? You're a fraud. <laughs> yeah, it, it didn't sound very good, did it? Is this a joke? What? Hey, kid, show some respect. You wanted to contact your deceased beloved, and the voices of the new age allowed you to do so. What else do you want? This isn't about my deceased beloved. It's about a deceased mini pig, Cuthbert. <laughs> well, that that changes things, of course. Oh God, do I have to make another door. <gasps> Damn it! Um, I think that's funny. You're defrauding grieving people who trust you. No, that's that's not how it is. Trust me, I know what this looks like. But honestly, nine times out of ten, these deceased souls say the same thing. <laughs> I love you, I'm waiting for you on the other side, darling here, darling there. <sighs> True. Do you have any idea how stressful a real seance is? I spend the rest of my day in bed with an arcane fever big enough to kill a troll. Come on, you understand? I mean, I'm not You're very magical, but sure. The prophet's meant to be very magical. I have about as much magic as in my little pinky finger. <laughs> not, not much of a mage. And what about the potion, the elixir of cosmic wind? Still, this isn't fair. These people who came to you, they trust you. Oh, that? Um... Oh my god, so I've just... Just say it helps to put me in the right mood. Oh my god. <laughs> well, this isn't fair. Not necessarily to me. I find this quite amusing. But to other people? <sighs> well, maybe you're right. But how does it help if I turn into an Orbaya someday? 
Honestly, you have no idea how many people just want to talk to their sweethearts. So I could either turn them down or, well, improvise. At least it gives them hope, I guess. Um, real seance, so you actually can talk to the dead. It just takes a lot more energy out of you than needed. Well, not exactly. But you know the basic principle of magic, right? Everything that is, everything that was, and everything that will be exists within the sea of eventualities. Dead people are dead, but they leave an echo. A spirit like I know about that. Of what they once were. In other words, your customers talk to some kind of echo? Well, that's one way to describe it, yes. Does that mean that you can help me get in touch with Tabacus's mini pig? No, that's too... Wait, did you say... Tabacus? Maxis? Tabacus? I did. Maxis Tabacus, the alchemist from Duneville. Yes, he's my employer. Oh, well, um, <clears throat> if that's the case... <laughs> well, fair enough. I might be able to make an exception. You have something of that pig with you, don't you? What was his name again? Albert? Cuthbert, and yes, here are some of his bristles. Hmm, show me. Yes, this should do the trick. Give me a moment. Aye aye, I will do. I quite like this character. <laughs> Even though she tried to con me, like... Fair. <laughs> oh, here's the pig. Well, then, Hiya. Cuthbert the pig. Ta -da. How do I know it's just not a random pig? That's it? No voices of the new age? No. That's just to add a bit of flair. Flair was a now, don't look bit at strong, I have to admit. You. Most of my customers expect candlelight and scary rituals, so I deliver. I... Uh, uh, blasted blistering blazes. Oh, this bloody fever. Oh, look, whatever you're planning on doing with Cuthbert, do it now. I need a nap and a sip of ambrosia. Wait, what now? How do I get him to talk? And how long does this spell last? How long does it last? That depends entirely on Cuthbert. Once he gets bored, so he could vanish, vanish now because we're not talking and to him. First question, you'll have to find that out for yourself. But do come A back talking when you're pig. Done, will you? you um, <clears throat> you have to tell me how you got old tobacco to hide. Oh, you like him, do you? Purely professional interest, of course. So long. Find a way to get Manfred to lead you to the certificate. Is that what it said? Aurora performed the ritual of the voices of the new age so that I can talk to a deceased person. It became apparent that she planned a fraud to conserve her energy and became because she feared the arcane fever. After I explained that I wanted to come in contact with the teacup pig and that I was sent by Maxis Tabacus, um, she wanted to help me and summoned Cuthbert's ghost. Now I have to figure out where it buried the diploma. Oh my god, this quest. Good pig, I'm working for your old man. Um, he thinks you buried his diploma. Good pig. Um, hello? Cuthbert cocks his head and looks at you questioningly. Questioningly, His belly gives a rumble. Give something to eat for Cuth Cuthbert from Aurora's tower. Um, what do you like to eat, sir pig? I presume pigs eat anything. Some roasted salmon. Fried fish, yummy, tasty fish. Okay, doesn't like salmon. I don't either, that's fine. That was sweet braid, sugar braid. Crusty bread, ever seen bread so crusty? Didn't think so. Eyes the bread critically, then he eats the entire slice in one bite. His ethereal tusks glide through your hands and... Oh, I didn't read the rest of that. <laughs> Likes the bread then, me too. <laughs> Cuthbert's visions added to the spell book. Find the diploma with the help of Cuthbert's visions. Okay. Bye pig, it seems that Cuthbert taught me a strange spell. I can follow its trail through the powder desert. With the help of Cuthbert's visions, will I be able to find the diploma by following the trail? Okay.
Well, let's get out of here at least. See if the spell works. Oh my god, I've got fever as well. I need to cure myself. What will it be under? Cuthbert's visions. Here we go. I will favourite it. Enable establishes a connection to Cuthbert's ghost for a short period of time to allow you to follow his trail. It works like this. I understand. I don't know why I unequipped it then. Right, let's cure my disease a second. If I have potions for it. I'm not sure if I do. Here we go. It's done, yeah? Yeah. Alright, well next time we'll continue with this interesting quest, <laughs> follow the pig's trail. Um, but yeah, we'll do that next time, so be sure to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you then. Goodbye guys.